Gentlemen, welcome back to the Dirty Pat Walsh channel on YouTube with me, your host, Dirty Pat Walsh. Uh, I got a new subscriber, and the name the name of the person escapes me, but I'm going to do my shout out list video tomorrow. So, yeah, make make note and mention it then. So. Um, so yeah, I've been fucking so busy these days, man, and, uh, working on this dance piece with Wes, and playing with I Am Made of Fire, we had our, our I think our third or fourth gig the other night, it went, went pretty well. But the reason I'm here is because I, I don't feel like I've been doing my job as uh, the CEO, Canadian CEO of Bone Daddy uh, Ghetto Microphones. And uh, what what reminded me of that, and I'm sure I'm sure he didn't, I'm sure he just wanted to promote it, but Bone Daddy himself made an amazing promo video for this microphone here. So I thought I watched it and it's it's an awesome video. Bone Daddy's the coolest fucking dude. Um and I thought, you know, I should really I haven't really talked about this microphone much since he sent it to me. I was all jazzed up on my dip can mic and uh but we're going to talk about this one today. Now, this is basically a, a Shure 57, uh, kind of cut cut down and put inside this body. Um, it's a great vocal mic. Uh, it's very different. It's very different than all, all of the other microphones I've tried by him because most, most of the other elements that he uses are like uh, telephone elements or... A, a, I think it's called a static uh, elements. They're not, they're like microphones, but they're not like vocal microphones that you find on a stage. This is like uh, a hack, like a, a, a hacked up, re, refurbished microphone that you would, I don't mean hacked up in a bad way. I mean, he, he cut it down and put a casing on it. Um, but this is a microphone that you would find on a stage. I used to play these all the time uh, in the Silver Hearts. This was my favorite stage mic. Because when I played in the Silver Hearts, I didn't cup cup and play like, like that. I, I just had a microphone on a stand. And I just, you know, played into that sitting down. Uh, and the 57s, we usually got 57s or 58s to play with wherever we were, wherever we landed. And uh, if there was a 57, I would always grab it because it's um, it's great for harmonica. So, but it's got a whoa, turn down the dirt on the mic on the amp here. Check 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 check. So as you can see, this is a great vocal microphone. Um, let me get a harmonica here. Now the thing about these, this microphone I found is uh, it's quite loud um, when it comes to what I'm usually dealing with on a Bone Daddy microphone. Um, yeah, it's, uh, but it's great. It's got a, I'm going to play a bit for you.
that's uh, it's amazing. It's a great microphone, you know, uh, really good for like band practice and uh, like I haven't I haven't tried it out on stage yet, but our next gig I'll probably use it. Um, totally. The difference between that and like a uh, Bone Daddy Can is like this. Like this one sounds like you're talking through a telephone because it's like a telephone microphone in here. And I love this microphone like nuts. I, I just fucking love it. But uh, but if you want more of an actual microphone that it sounds like a, a mic like a public address microphone this is a and one that you can throw a lot of dirt into and play some wicked harmonica through this is an excellent choice um i think this would this microphone would be better suited if i actually owned a large amp um i don't i don't own a large amp i have uh this is out of the three amplifiers I have, this is the biggest one I got. So, and it's run by a battery. Um, but yeah, throw this into like, uh, you know, like a Marshall or a whatever. I think it would be wicked, you know. So, anyway, these microphones are in production right now. And you can get them for 35 bucks, I think it is. Uh, and the only way to get them is to look up Bone Daddy's Ghetto Microphones on, on Facebook. It's a like page, and uh, you can contact him directly there. And he'll get right back to you. And uh, Bone Daddy is the coolest. He's the coolest dude ever. He's just awesome. Um, yeah, so this mic, it gets a total vote of victory from, from Dirty Pat Walsh. It's a, it's phenomenal for many reasons. All of the microphones he sends me, they're all different and they're all wonderful for different applications. So I'm very, very, uh, grateful to have that, uh, uh, that variety in my life right now because I'm playing a lot of harmonica and a lot of things call for different things, you know, like different, like, like, uh, the, the setup I'm using for, uh, me and Wes's performances. I'm using my other, uh, little red screamer, not this one, but, um, the little static one. Uh, and I'm using, I'm running it through my smoky battery, my little wee smoky battery powered amp and I'm keeping it in my, in my breast pocket. And with a little, like a little mini cord, so it's just, it's very discreet. It goes up to my mouth, like you know. And uh, you know, what am I saying? This is an amazing microphone. If you have any interest in cool ass, lo-fi microphones for any application, check out Bone Daddy. He makes he makes the best stuff. He's just, I I couldn't be. Uh, I couldn't be prouder to be affiliated with uh, Bone Daddy's ghetto microphones. It's a it's a great honor to me, and uh, yeah. So there you go. The little red screamer fifty seven gets you one. Oh yeah. So yeah. I'm playing lots of harmonica. And, uh, drinking a lot of Coke these days, too. I think it's time for a dip. A dip, a dip, a dip. Because, uh, I've got one other, one other thing to mention in this vlog. It's dipping, uh, Stoker's Long Cut Natural right now. Going through my my tub of it 
it's funny, like, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's good. It's good. Cheers. Anyhow, I usually start my, my, uh, video watching day. I, I always try to keep us on top of my friends, my YouTube friends as much as I possibly can. And, uh, that was why I usually open my day with watching the suit and tie dip and chew guy, uh, given his review or his talk on like his cha channel, channel news or whatever. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, it's just a good way to, you know, I put a dip in and watch suit and tie dip and chew guy. You know, often at night when I'm having my last dip of the night, I'll be watching uh, Bergs because he he uploads at nine o'clock at night usually. And Dip and Chew Guy uh, usually uploads like two in the morning, so I see him when I wake up. But um, he said that in his sometime coming up, he wants to have a question and answer thing with his viewers and uh i realized you know that's something i've never done and uh i i've seen it happen a lot and uh so i'm gonna throw that out to the universe i'm gonna say in the comments ask me fucking anything and uh as long as you're polite <laughs> as long as you're an ally or whatever i don't know you know what i mean um as long as you're not being a dick, I will answer you. And uh, so we'll have, I'll call out for people to throw questions at me in this video. And maybe in a few days, I'll, if people have responded, I'll gather them up. And uh, give you all the answers. Um, and you can ask me anything about anything that you uh, wonder about the life of Dirty Pat Walsh and how I got to be sitting in Sound Kitchen Studios here right now talking to you. So, all right. So, yeah, ask me fucking anything in uh, AMFA. That's right. And fuck... Get one of these if you have any you, any need for a microphone, any interest in lo-fi microphones, any any notion at all. Uh, please support Bone Daddy Ghetto microphones in your in your uh, journey. Uh, you will not be disappointed. I guarantee it. And uh, yeah. So that's that, I guess. Until the next one, I will see you later. Be well and stay free. And thank you for all your support. Bye now.